What well, is YouTube? It's your boy, Mr. Jenkins. We back at it. It's the same thing. Hold on. We back at it. Uh, I got the same clothes on because I just shot another unboxing video. So if you see another unboxing video with this on, that's because it's 10 minutes after that. All right. Anyway. Uh, yeah. So we got another unboxing video. And I'm going to have one more after this. Okay. So it's going to be three with this same fit on. So chill on me. But anyway, we got another, got another uh, unboxing today. Another one of my... It's better it came in a box, bro. Another one of my, uh, I would call my, a pair that I never thought would happen. Hold on. Okay, they did come with a box. I was about to say. Anyways, though, yes, it's another one of my, uh, prized possessions. You know me. You know I love this guy. Kobe. That's all I'm going to say. I'm going to start it there, okay? If you see the box, you might already have a, have a clue. But this pair, I'm gonna say the same thing as my last video. Uh, I never, honestly, never thought I was gonna be able to get this pair of shoes or anything. I never thought I was gonna be able to get this pair of shoes. If you haven't already seen, no, I'm not gonna show you that. Anyway, I didn't think I was gonna be able to get these pair of shoes, especially because when he died, the price has skyrocketed. This is a pair that came out in 2014. It was a, it was a hard time, man. I, in 2014, there was no chance I was gonna get them because they came out online only, and you know how that works. Even back then, when shoes weren't even straight online, you knew back then you wasn't getting something that came out online. Just simple as that. And then the resale was thousands of dollars. But you know, you know, I catch them on the steal. You know, I ain't paying no stupid price for the for no kicks. So shout out to eBay. That's if I mean I might do a video on how to cop shoes for cheap on eBay because I actually learned from YouTube. So if you want me to do that video, comment below. Let me know. Um, yeah. Some of the stuff I catch on eBay is ridiculous prices, so just gotta be patient. If you want me to do that video, comment below, let me know. But before we do that, drop a like on this video. And um Yeah, we're just gonna get right into this thing, man. If you know, you know. I'm gonna let y'all, of course, you know, I'm gonna let y'all get the sneak people So close my eyes, you know. Okay, nine right now. Okay, okay. I hope y'all seen that, but if you didn't, too bad. Oh, Give me a minute to check them out. Give me a minute to the to, to glade to graze in this glory. Checking out conditions too, because you know, a lot of people think if you buy something off eBay, that's it once you got it. That's not true at all. You can return. Alright. My fault. You had to inspect, go inspect the gadget on them. Had to. Boom! Kobe 5 prelude. This is my favorite. This was my favorite, uh, dang, I didn't see that. I'm gonna show y'all a little song on this. This is my, this is probably my favorite from that pack, man. Um, I don't think it was a better shoe in the Prelude pack than this Kobe 5. So, let's get in. If you don't know, the, uh, like I said, the Prelude pack came from when Kobe retired in 2014. He, they re-released, they re-retroed all of his shoes. And they gave each one of them a little meaning. So, this Prelude pack was, I mean, this Prelude shoe is the Kobe 5, obviously, is dedicated to his finals MVP. Like I said, they dedicated each one to a special moment in Kobe's career. It's inspired by pop art and his finals MVP. So, I actually think this missile is glow in the dark. If I come, come, I think so. Comment below, let me know. But you see the crazy vibrant colors on the tongue. Got the gold Kobe logo outlined with the red. The laces are blue, red, you see it, just pop with the shoe. Um, I like these because they're like a painting, so it's like the craziest one to me. And the scuffs and scratches you see are like that. The shoe isn't scuffed and scratched. That's how it comes, you know, it's just art. Um, Kobe 5, of course, has two, it's a little dirty on that, on that sole, but if you can see, it's a 2-4 right there. The other one, of course, has the 8. Coming around the side, you know, everything in it on here is flat, so it's not a it's not a check you can actually feel. Of course, you still got the fly wire in there. You can see that glow in the dark. So Kobe even has uh, look like it's painted there too. Now this pair is actually in, oh hold on. Like I said, when I go on eBay, I only buy things in, that are actually in good condition as well. You can't really see this, but this patch is a little dirty. I don't know. How. So if you don't know, each prelude comes with a patch. 
this patch is a little dirty. I'm gonna see if I can clean it up. Oh, uh, so in here, if you can't see that, it's obviously gonna have the. So the first part is a Roman numeral up top. You can't see that because the light. Damn, my bad. Yeah, you can't see that. I'm sorry. Okay, just trust me though. The first part, I'm gonna show you another shoe. But I just did the, if you haven't seen this one, I just did the reaction on this, or the unboxing on this one. So you see how that top is a Roman numeral that you have what it's dedicated to? So this, the top is a V, and then here it says Finals MVP. You have the Roman numeral under that here that says 2000 MMX, 2010. So that's when you won Finals MVP, obviously. Um, yeah, now this pair, like I said, if you if you don't know, you can return stuff on eBay. This pair is a little bit more worn than I thought it was, but we still don't have any heel drag. So, Kobe Lowe goes purple. You still don't have any heel drag. The soles are in good condition. So, that, that to me is the biggest factor. I mean, obviously, I'm not going to wear these much anyway, so I don't really care much. I do care. That's why I would still not buy stuff that's all beat up. But you can see everything is in still good condition. Everything is there's no drag on that. So I'm satisfied. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm Gucci. But one thing I do not like, I ain't gonna lie. This part here, if you can see that, it's a little cut right there. Ooh, I didn't I didn't like that. I'm not gonna lie to you. Other than that, ain't no ain't, ain't no complaints. I'm just happy to have finally have a shooter that I didn't think I'd be able to get. Honestly, Mike Wordy, I want to wear them a couple times, maybe, but at this point in my life, I just get shoes, especially Kobe's. Everything to me has to have a value and a meaning, and this is one of just this is one of those, you know. Anyway, and I didn't even show you the, what's called it, Kobe Five Pre Loop. Let me show you the size tag in case anybody care. Boom. But if you're still here, drop a like on this video, subscribe, check out some reaction videos, unboxings, vlog, all that on the channel. It's your boy, Miss Jenkins. I appreciate you watching. I'm out.